up you guys today we are talking brown brushes i am a professional hairstylist and a lot of times i have clients who have no idea what type of brown brush to buy so today i'm going to go through this set and the four sizes that it comes with and help you figure out which one to buy these are nanotech pro hair brushes they are boar bristle brushes so let's open them up and check them out Okay, so in each, there is a set of four free clips. Tight grip, good metal sectioning clips have a nice heavy jump back to them. Um, let's go from small to large. So the first size, the one inch nanotechnology ceramic and ionic AMI brush. This one inch small brush, I can fit my hand around this one. So these brushes are for people with short hair. So pixie cuts, men with longer hair, pompadour, these are for those really hard to get in places right at the root. The smaller the brush, the more curl you're going to get. You can also use this on your hair if you want more of a bend, more of a curl, more of a wave. Moving on this size, then I'll close my hand around this. This is 1.3 inches, one and a half of the smaller brushes. This is for people with a little bit longer hair, maybe like a pixie that's grown out a little bit. This can be used for bobs, lobs, any kind of short haircut will work with this brush. Moving on, this brush is probably the most versatile brush. This is the 1.7 inch and it's mainly my go-to brush because it can work on majority of people. Here is the size comparison to my hand. So it is 0.5 four inches bigger than this one, 1.7 inches. Was made for medium length hair, however, you can use long hair on this if you want a little bit more of a blowout look. So medium length to long hair. Now moving on to the big boy, this is the two inch, so 0.3 of an inch, wider than the 1.7. My hand fits around about half of it. This is the biggest brush in this set, but this is not the biggest round brush that you can use. However, I don't tend to grab for ones bigger than this. This is for long hair and it can create itchy waves or a nice beveled look. All of these brushes are to help make your blowout smooth and to have the ends of of your hair be rounded and polished. These are a great tool. They are a little bit hard to learn in the beginning, but once you get it, you can do it with your eyes closed. The bigger the size, the straighter and smoother the look. The smaller the size, the more curled and smooth look. If you were wanting to style your bangs beveled under, you would use a smaller brush because it gives more of a curl. Now let's go ahead and give it a try. So if I wanted to re refresh my hair, I would first brush it out. I'm going to use the Incommon Magic Mist because it has heat protectant in it. So I'm just going to spray this on the front of my hair, brush it in. This is the Launch Stylist Blow Dryer. It's a professional blow dryer. I love this thing so much. I'm going to take my 1.7 inch brush. My hair is mostly straight, so I'm just doing this for volume and a little bit of a refresh. This is the Kendra Platinum Working Spray. Very, very light and you can brush through it. I spray this and let this go. See that volume that I have up here? Gives you that nice little face framing. A little more working spray. And voila, you've got volume in the front. 